Born in Middelburg, Mpumalanga in 1935, Esther Mahlangu has become the ambassador of South Africa's South Ndebele heritage and art. She started painting at the age of 10, taught by her mother and grandmother in the tradition of decorating walls. Fast forward a few decades, she's traveled the world and has collaborated with numerous museums and global brands. She wants the heritage preserved. <laughs> I teach the kids, as I do not want the art to die off. The kids draw with their open heart and they also like the art. I'm very much happy that they practice the art. It will not fade away. They will grow knowing about it, the way I also learned from my grandmothers. Today, a Rolls-Royce Phantom was unveiled bearing her unique designs. Her signature style comes to life on this one-of-a-kind vehicle's glass panel on the dashboard. The collaboration an honour for the luxury brand. The whole idea behind the gallery is in order for you to be able to personalise it. And we took advantage of this opportunity and are actually the first car in the world to offer a painted piece of artwork done by a very well-known and world-famous artist, Dr. Mshlangu, uh, in this particular car. A solo exhibition, Disrupting Patterns, which comprises a number of her paintings in the bold geometric style of Ndebele art, is currently on display in Cape Town. A lot of your celebrity crowd um, she seems to have built almost or developed an iconic kind of pop status of her own. And Alicia Keys and Swiss Beats recently bought commissioned a big work for the Dean collection. Um, but John Legend, Usher, um, Trevor Noah recently. Maestra has collected a host of accolades over the course of her career, including an honorary doctorate and South Africa's Order of Ikamanga. She has no plans of retiring anytime soon. Vanessa Puna, SABC News, Cape Town.